Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. In 1984, NBC debuted a courtroom comedy called Night Court, and it would quickly become a huge hit. It would run for a full nine seasons. The show had a stellar cast, including Marsha Warfield, who played one of the court bailiffs named Rosalind Roz Russell. In this video, I take a look back at Miss Warfield's career leading up to the landing the role on Night Court. And I also look at what she's been doing since Night Court aired its final episode in 1992. Now, Marsha Warfield began a career in television and comedy back in the late 1970s. She appeared in the four episode TV series, The Richard Pryor Show, in 1977. And she would later comment about that experience and state that the kind of comedy that Richard Pryor did was the kind of comedy she was trying to learn how to do. She would describe it as doing stuff you care about and you get to bring issues to the forefront and punch up at sacred cows. In 1979, she would win the fourth annual San Francisco International Stand Up Comedy Competition. Among other contenders that year was Dana Carvey of Saturday Night Live fame. Also throughout the early 80s, she would make appearances in a number of television shows and movies, such as the film DC Cab from 1983 that was your basic 80s screwball comedy with an ensemble cast of funny characters including the young Marsha Warfield, Mr. T, Gary Busey, and Adam Baldwin. She also appeared in four episodes of the TV series Riptide as a character named Max who was a comedian working at Straightaways, a restaurant on the pier and she can even be seen in an episode of Cheers from 1985. Then in 1986, she landed a role on Night Court as court bailiff Roz Russell. Now Roz was the third bailiff to work alongside fan favorite Bull Shannon, played by Richard Maul. She was preceded by Selma Diamond as bailiff Selma Hacker for the first two seasons, and Florence Halop who played bailiff Florence Kleiner in season three. Warfield would play Roz from season four through the end of the series run in 1992. She was so good in this role and it would appear in a total of 136 episodes. After Night Court went off the air, Warfield would play the role of Dr. Maxine Douglas in 50 episodes across the final two seasons of the Golden Girl spinoff, Empty Nest. But it seems like these days, Miss Warfield is back to doing her first love, stand-up comedy. Now, NBC recently launched a continuation to the 80s hit series Night Court, and many fans of the original series have wondered if any of the original cast, besides John Larroquette, would be returning. While nothing is currently confirmed in regards to Warfield making an appearance on the show, she posted a video where she wished the cast and crew of the show's revival the best of luck. Dan Rubin, the show's executive producer, has stated that the beauty of the series is that anyone can walk through those doors at any moment and that he would just say to stay tuned and maybe some old friends will show up. Now I would love to see her make an appearance on the show. Now here's where I want to hear from you. What are your favorite memories of Marsha Warfield from Night Court? And who remembers that crazy 80s movie DC Cab with Mr. T? I look forward to reading your comments. Also, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel where I discuss pop culture from the 70s, 80s, 90s, and beyond. Now, thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there and have a great day.